Hi Virgo, this is your channel messages for Virgo placement, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and another node. Virgo, check your check the description box below to look to see what is in your chart. Virgo, while I was pre-shuffling, I got the Moon card and I got the Devil. So someone's Luciferian, okay? I'm getting a woman. I'm getting a morning star or the eastern star. Who, who, what do you call Lucifer? The morning star or the eastern star? But I'm getting Lilith. So somebody has Oog. Somebody has Scorpio and a Pluto. All right. If you have Scorpio in Pluto, nobody can fucking compete with you. Nobody. Nobody. They couldn't match you at your blood clot worse. Your worst hair day would be someone else's best hair day. If you have Pluto in a Scorpio placement, all Pluto in a Scorpio, you are unmatchable. Remember, Pluto ruled death and rebirth. Scorpio ruled death and rebirth. So now Scorpio is in home planet of Pluto. That means every single day you're dead. Every single day you look like a new person. You look like somebody different every day. Your ear change every day. Your face look like it change every day. Your accent change every day. Yeah, because you have Pluto and a Scorpio. You die. You freeze to death. You die every day. But we also know that when it comes on to laboratory studies and studies when it comes on to discovering more about the human body and how it can be preserved, you usually have to freeze things and then after a few years, unfreeze them so they can time travel, right? I'm getting Pluto in Scorpio. Somebody have a Pluto in Scorpio placement. Congratulations, you is the shit. You is the blood clot shit. Nobody can compete with that. Bruh, you have Pluto in a Scorpio. Congratulations. That's all I said. What, where's the... God favorited you. Yeah, God did like... God didn't really like you. When you, when you came in and lined up, God did this. Here's Pluto in Scorpio. Yeah. That is one hell of a fucking placement, I'll tell you that. We have an H coming out first. All right, so H. We have an X. We got an L. We got a heart. We got a D. You know DHL? DHL. Isn't that a com? Isn't that a, uh, DHL? I know DHL. I used DHL when I was in Jamaica. DHL is a shipping company. So something about a ship, a shipment, or you're waiting on something to come in from abroad, okay? You're waiting on an order. I see a ring. I'm seeing something about an engagement ring. Are you ordering an engagement ring online for somebody? I feel like you're... Virgo, are you proposing? <laughs> I see a ring, I see a ring. And we have N. Is that a no? <laughs> Virgo, my heart, Jesus Christ, Canada. This sun is, this is not sunny, no, this is a laser. You know that? This fuck is not real. This cannot be real. This is a laser. Let us go. Virgo, the clothing man, the hermit, Abraham, the hanged man, okay? So you're seeing something from a whole new perspective, okay? The hanged man. No, this could be birth charts. You're seeing what, what it really means, what placement means. Or you're like, oh my God, that's so real. That's so true. Yeah, it's true. You see, I feel like, uh, I feel like you want somebody to convince you of something that you don't believe in, but the proof is there. I feel like something is undeniable, um, Virgo. We have toxic relationship, all right? Maybe you feel like, yeah, we have pictures and videos. Maybe you feel like somebody very vain, like all them care about is them appearance. All them care about is how them look. All them care about, you think somebody toxic or somebody superficial or somebody is materialistic. I don't think they are, Virgo. Virgos are earth signs. Earth signs are usually very, very grounded. 
they're perfectionists when it comes on to them image but they're not attention they're not necessarily attention seekers I feel like you're looking at a picture or a video of somebody and every time you see them they look different it's because they have Pluto in Scorpio all right it's not a demon it's not a demonic possession okay it's Pluto in Scorpio all right there's no demons in there and we have the high priestess Exactama Exactama Je dis ça I said that I said this the high priestess every time you see the high priestess the high priestess look different every time I see the high priestess I don't know it's like them change it's Pluto in Scorpio one of the most placements love it I love that placement oh my god and we have bright future the high priestess and bright future so I'm getting you're going to be getting your birth chart read you want to see your birth chart you want to see the characteristics why am I this way? Why do I love this way? Why am I like for argue? Why am I like for cheat? Why am I like for have sex with so much man? Why do I like to take men money and don't call them back? It is in your birth chart. I'm getting you're going to get your birth chart read by the high priestess, okay? The birth chart, everything is in the birth chart. I tell people all the time. When you can't talk about parents, when you can't talk about church, when you can't talk about school, everything is in the birth chart. Period. Let's go. Bright future. You've got a bright future or somebody else does. I am getting birth charts. You're having your birth chart read. You're seeing your birth chart for the first time. You're looking on your birth chart. And you're like, whoa. You're like, oh my God, I have this. Oh my God, I have this. Yeah, we have the four of cups. All right. I'm getting, you notice that your attention span is very, very short. Look if you have Gemini in a Mercury. Look where, look in your birth chart, where is Gemini? Look which planet it rule. If Gemini is in Mercury, that is why. You're constantly bored, you constantly have to switch, you're constantly, it's like you'll start a movie and then you don't want to watch the movie. It's because of your Gemini placement. I'm getting a huge order of a lot of birth charts being filled, okay? So if you're a tarot reader or a spiritual practitioner, I feel like for the next two weeks, the only thing you're going to do is read birth chart. You're not even going to read tarot. Okay? So the four of cups. We have the three of swords. We have the seven of pentacles. And we have the four of cups. And we have the magician. I'm getting Leo. Who? Somebody Leo. Something about a Leo. I'm getting Virgo. You thought the reason why every day somebody is getting up and looking their best and looking pretty is because they were cheating. Maybe you had a stay-at-home wife or you had a girlfriend you live with. And every day she gets up, no, no. It's like she look our best, she have on our nails, she have on hair. And you're like, who the fuck are you seeing when I'm going to work? I'm getting the person who wasn't seeing anybody. I'm getting you was at work, right? And for some reason, you're thinking about the appearance of your girlfriend or the appearance of your wife. And you're saying to yourself, who, who, who am I get? Who are they getting ready for? What is happening when I leave for work? Does this person still find me attractive? I feel like you start getting insecure or you start questioning yourself a lot. Maybe you were even taking up extra time at work because you were like, you know what? Yeah, it's over. It's done. The person not in love with me anymore. The person cheating on me. I feel like you were going on. It's like you're at work and you're thinking about what your significant other was doing at home. Exactly. So the house here, the, four, the house. It's like you were thinking, what, what is this person doing when I'm at work? I feel like you even come home in a very, very aggravated nature, right? And even when you come home in an aggravated nature accusing somebody of cheating on you, I feel like the person still met you with, Hi, honey, how was your day? You feel like when you were leaving for work, somebody was getting all glammed up for another man. No, somebody I get glammed up for you, for when you come off of work. And this can be your even work. You work in a field where you're very dirty. All the time you're dirty. 
And then you go home and you see a wife or you see a girlfriend and she decked out her nails do her hair is on point. Man, you know a man with a drop at her feet for drink her bath water. You know this? I feel like I start getting insecure, Virgo. And the insecurity start cause unnecessary arguments. When really all you wanted was, sweetie, you're the only person I have my eye on. That's really what you want. You wanted some words of encouragement. You wanted reassurance from your partner. But for some reason, the anger, the rage, and the jealousy turned into, you're cheating on me. I'm not doing anything for you anymore. You know what? It's over. It's done. You know what? I better fuck my co-worker too. High Priestess and Bright Future. You made a mistake, Virgo. You made a mistake. And Virgos don't like to admit that they make mistakes. But Virgo, you made a mistake. What is the three of... Yeah, the world card, it's over though. So the relationship ended. Somebody decided to leave. Alright? No, no, with pictures and videos, I'm seeing something about a picture of a naked body. Like somebody taking a picture like this. And then naked. I, I, okay, it's like somebody, like somebody have a phone and then I take a picture like... I'm seeing breasts, them, them expose them breasts. They may not have exposed the other area, but I'm seeing them take a picture of them naked self. To, maybe this is something you found in them phone. That's how you know they were cheating. You are at work, you come back, you're looking at them phone and you see naked pictures. Who are they sending these naked pictures to? I feel like they were trying to send them to you while you were at work. I know it sounds very weird, but high priestess, bright future, toxic relationship, the hangman, but feel like you realize something now. Or you realize you ended a breakup and false information, the information they got wasn't even correct. You think somebody has sent photos, them have sent videos to other men? No, them they are trying to send it to you. But maybe the constant arguments, they've never bothered, them just like, you know what, fuck it. Yeah, we have a six of cups here. The conversation. Why it's so hot, Leo? The conversation. Wait, Leo. I'm getting someone misses you so much. Especially with pictures and videos. Someone is looking at old pictures, old videos of you. And they're like, how do I get it again? How can I go back to somebody that I have accused every single day that cheated on me? Yes, the Scorpio here, the death card. I'm getting Scorpio in Pluto. Or something about your Pluto placement. Getting the relationship ended though. What's the, what is the six, seven of ones? The star card. So someone was a celebrity, there was a star, they had a bright future ahead of them, they do actually. So someone is a psychic reader, or they're a terror reader, very known, well known. Even if they're underground, they're very well known, okay? People know this person, alright? So that could have been it too, the insecurity. Pictures and videos, so someone works online. As a high priestess, I, I feel like your insecurity is what? Ten of cups. Yes, yeah, someone was happy in the relationship. I feel like you did feel like somebody wasn't happy. Or you start get insecure because somebody has start, they might gain traction. I am so hot, man. Somebody start gain traction now. People start talking about this person. Their name are being called in rooms. Like people, people. people I'm getting the high priestess, which is a terror reader, which is a cultist. I'm getting a lot of people that talk about you. They're, talk, they're, they're talking about you. They're talking about your work. They're talking about your future. They're talk. They're just a talk. That's all I'm doing. And I'm getting maybe you were, you felt insecure or you felt like you were in someone's shadow. Because now you're with this big star, this big celebrity. And it's like, oh, I'm just a guy who works in this place and I come home dirty all the, day, all the days of my life. I feel like someone was happy with you but you thought that somebody was too big of a star or you feel like somebody would have 
wanted better, wanted to move on to better things. But but Virgo, this is the high priestess. This is not a dancer or a singer. This is not somebody who wants to pursue music or acting or actress. That's not an actress. It's a high priestess, Virgo. So maybe you were jealous because somebody was more successful in the in the limelight than you. Every every time you go to work, people are talking about this person. Hey, can you get my birth chart read? Hey, can you do this for me? Hey, can you do this? And I feel like it annoys you. And all of the, uh, on top of it annoying you, you're already insecure. You already feel like them are cheat on you. So I'm getting arguments, fucked up everything, and it ended. But I'm getting the high priestess still is going to go on to stardom. Them still are going to make it. Ten of cups, with or without you. Because somebody, this is someone's calling. That is their rightful destiny. Their destiny is to be a high priestess and destiny is to read. This is not no, hi, so much, thank you so much for calling customer service. My name is, there's another them type of blood clot work there. That's for other people. That is for the people who are stuck in the matrix. That is not for you. Welcome to Chili's. I know you that. You're not in a fast food restaurant. You're not, no. Yeah? Hi, hi. No. Okay, okay. You're not them type of people there. Eh? You're the blood clot high priestess. You're out of the matrix. You're not in the matrix. You're not a slave to the system anymore. So maybe somebody else was. Somebody was stuck in a 9 to 5 job. Them stuck in a them, you know, trying to climb the corporate ladder. Trying to make ends meet. Them stuck in a them job while you're a high priestess. So somebody's job is required manual labor. It's required for them to be dirty or grimy. And your job is for people to talk about you. Your job is for everybody to call your name. That is your calling. Worse if you have Pluto in a Scorpio, that is your calling. It's not a customer service thing. On a short course thing. You have a bright fucking future. Bright. Bright like Tyler. The, what, bright like what? A Tyler M name? What name? Tyler. I don't remember my name. Bright, bright, bright. You're, you're going to be up there with him. Yeah, you understand? E, MTV, Keeping Up With The Spencers, BOJ TV, TVJ, one of them. Yes, you will be having your own blood clot segment. Don't you blood clot worry? Don't you worry? I feel like you're going to be reading a lot of people's birth charts and, and giving people insight into their own future. Because if you can tell, if, if you can tell somebody else's future, I just saw the money there. I just saw the starship there. I just saw it there. You can look in a person's birth chart and you say, yeah, this person's a cheater. You look in a person's birth chart, you say, yeah, she can't be trusted. You look in a somebody's birth chart, you say, yeah, this girl will fuck my man. <laughs> it in there, it is there. <laughs> I'm getting Virgo, you, you, like you're happy, you're happy. I'm not going to say you have to bow down Virgo, but you have to give Caesar credit where credit is due. You're trying to compete with somebody, you cannot. Them is the high priestess. You're trying to troll somebody, you cannot. Them is the high priestess. You are trying to gang up on somebody, you cannot. Them is the high fucking priestess. This is their, their place is in the fucking sky. Them place in the stars. This is not a this isn't their place is not on paper. This this place is not to sign a contract. This place is to be in front of TV every blood clot day and people are watching every blood clot day. People are going to stalk you every day and that is okay. Because you're the high priestess. Because you have the secrets what everybody wants. But you're selected of who you tell. Give me one more. Page of cups. We have the five of cups. Alright. Knight of swords just came out. You know what I'm getting Virgo? <laughs> And we have the three of wands, Virgo, six of, seven of pentacles, Virgo. I'm getting, if you cannot beat them, you're going to fucking join them. I'm getting, you're going to get your birth chart read. So everything came round full circle. That's like you're there with a girl, oh, tell me about it. That's like you're there with one girl, Virgo, and the girl tell you, say, I'm going to be a terror reader, you know, I'm going to be a huge star. And you say, right, right, right. 
and somebody end up turn a blood clot star and now you even convinced for get your birth chart read when you had it for free in your house it was free free like blood clots here it is free in your house but you never believe in it and that's the thing you know people will never believe in you until other people believe in you people will troll you people will say that never going that will never happen people will tell you that will never work people will laugh after you I said that your idea, this you want to do, your blood clot mad. But guess what? You have to wait because when everything pick up and everybody jump on the bag wagon, then everybody go want the service. So you cannot worry about people who are not enlightened. If them not enlightened, you have to leave them there. You only guide the enlightened people. You guide the people them who third eye open already. So keep doing what you're doing, Virgo. If this is you. And if this is not you, the person is going to keep doing what they're doing because them rightful place is in the stars. Them supposed to be talked about. Right? Pictures and videos. Shh, para paparazzi every blood clot there. Right? And that's why your relationships has been so toxic, Virgo. Bakaya can't read. I am going to leave it here, Virgo. I'm telling you, sometimes you, you don't know what you have until it's gone, Virgo. I'm telling you, it is distressful. <laughs> but let me tell you, Virgo, whoever you are dealing with, whoever this person is, them they're on the right path. Them they're on the right path, you hear? And I feel like you're going to be so fucking surprised when you see who start patronizing this person for them service. You are a ton of believer. As, you know that next up, say, Blessing off a flow like a river. Blessing off a flow like a river. Papa, you know, no, say man, a leader. Shatter them ready for press the trigger. Blessing off a flow like a river. Them turn them back, we turn them in a believer. Yeah, Virgo. Them turn them back, pan, we were turn them in a believer. Don't you worry. Remember, Virgo is Abraham. Remember, Virgo is a clothed man. Remember, Virgo is a mason. Don't make nobody tell you about your future, Virgo, when you see the blood clot future. Yeah, mad? Until next time, Meta Virgo. Meta.